Novi Sad. The name first appeared in 1694. It was founded on the soil where the Pannonian Sea once used to be. Today, it is the second largest city in Serbia. Situated 80 kilometers far from the capital city Belgrade, the economic, cultural and educational center of the autonomous province of Vojvodina grew on the banks of the Danube, facing the slopes of the first national park in Serbia, Fruška Gora. The junction of various cultures and nations, as well as the diverse historical heritage, have always given Novi Sad a special character. Since 1864, Novi Sad has been the home of the Matica Srpska, the oldest Serbian library and the first public research library in Serbia. Apart from the old town hall and the bishop's palace, the important testimony to Novi Sad's cultural development is the Serbian National Theatre, which observed the 150th anniversary. Novi Sad is famous for the Petrovaradin fortress and the old town placed on the bank of the Danube, which was for 500 years under the Hungarians and Austrians on the one hand and Turks on the other. A town on the rock as hard as its faith, once the old town, is today a constituent part of the city of Novi Sad. It is also the home of one of the biggest music festivals in southeastern Europe, Exit. The University of Novi Sad is the second biggest university in the country. Currently, it educates almost 50,000 students, which makes Novi Sad the city with 400,000 inhabitants, one of the biggest university centers in Serbia. According to the statistics, every eighth citizen of Novi Sad is a student. Educational system in this region of the country has centuries-old tradition. Starting with the 11th century till the year 2010, the history of education, that is now nine centuries old, was celebrated together with a half-century jubilee of the University of Novi Sad. Today, the university consists of 14 faculties, over 60 educational and scientific institutes, with 3,000 employed academic workers that are part of research and teaching staff. The Faculty of Sciences is an ambitious institution of higher education and scientific research, which conducts basic and applied research, predominantly in the field of fundamental sciences and interdisciplinary scientific domains. Since it was established in 1969 till today, the Faculty of Sciences constantly improves and achieves success in scientific research and development. Today, it stands for one of the leading institutions of higher education in Serbia with a significant scientific potential considering the great experience of its professors and researchers and young researchers who are especially taken care of at the faculty. The mathematical faculty is a modern, respectable, scientific and educational institution. But it does not want to lose its roots i želi da sačuva tradiciju dugu 40 godina. Ovaj fakultet kao osnovnu viziju i kao svoju strategiju ima politiku razvoja kvaliteta i izvrsnosti. I da bi to postigao, postavio je sledeće zadatke. Da se razvija kult znanja na fakultetu, da se stimuliše i da se unapređuje ljubav studenta prema učenju, prema nauci, prema naučno-istraživačkom radu, da se stimuliše individualnost i kreativnost kako studenta, tako i nastavnika, da se favorizuje i da se poštuje raznolikost i da se otvaraju našim studentima vrata sveta. At the moment, the faculty educates around 6,000 students, 400 of which are in the master or doctoral programs. The faculty employs over 500 people, 300 of them being teaching and research staff. Special attention is given to a continual professional development and improvement of the research personnel as well as to the quality of the teaching process through different study programs, scientific and professional conferences, lectures given by visiting professors and eminent foreign scientists and practical work which gives students hands-on experience as they face real-life challenges in their future work. 
The student's success and satisfaction is the most credible evaluation of the faculty's performance. 16 academics teach on the Faculty of Sciences. The Faculty of Sciences conducts teaching in 38 accredited study programs at all levels of academic studies, undergraduate, master, doctoral and vocational studies, according to the principles defined by the Bologna Declaration. The class and the scientific research are conducted on five departments. Department of Biology and Ecology, Department of Physics, Department of Geography, Tourism and Hotel Management, Department of Chemistry, Biochemistry and Environmental Protection, Department of Mathematics and Informatics. Students are offered excellent conditions for making progress in their work, together with a number of travel and study programs, so they can attend foreign universities through student exchange programs, student internship programs, international projects that the faculty participates in. The Diploma of the Faculty of Sciences is slowly but surely becoming visible and recognized worldwide thanks to our students and researchers who achieve successful careers abroad. The Faculty of Sciences is home to many students whose effort and hard work do not go unnoticed. The awards that the students win at numerous contests are true evidence of the quality of work done in their mother institution. In 2010, Many students were awarded and some of these awards include the Dr. Zoran Djinjic Scholarship, the Exit Foundation Scholarship, first place award for programming of the newest generation Android smartphones application platform, the award Crystal Bowl from the Collegium for Higher Education of Vojvodina Hungarians, the participation at the Science Forum Biovision in Lyon 2010 and many other. The Department of Biology and Ecology conducts education and research within six chairs. The Chair of Botany provides education and research in a great number of subjects regarding botany. The Chair of Physiology, Genetics and Histology organizes and conducts courses in animal physiology, genetics and comparative histology with embryology. General Zoology, Morphology and Invertebrate Systematics, Diversity of Invertebrate Fauna, Comparative Anatomy and Chordate Systematics, Zoology Practicum and many other related subjects. Besides, as a special section of the department, there is the Chair of Microbiology organized in the Microbiology Laboratory. The Chair of Human Biology and Biology Education and Teaching Methodology is a section of the department that deals with the historical development of biology as a science, the development and analysis of the methods applied in teaching biology to different age groups and various vocational groups. The Chair of Ecology and Environmental Protection provides teaching and research in biochemistry, molecular biology, hydrobiology, animal ecology, plant ecology and environmental protection. Za biološke nauke sam se opredelio iz jednostavnog razloga što bolje i kvalitetnije poznavanje prirode kao i sam odnos prema životnoj sredini je imperativ u savremenom dobu, tako da mislim da neću pogrešiti ako kažem da su stvari biologije i ekologija nauke u trendu. Inače sam trenutno u izradi svoje doktorske teze, eksperimentalni deo istraživanja sprovodim u trotskim šumama Šri Lanke na arborealnim rastama vodozemaca gde odlazim tri puta godišnje, ne bih li prikupio neophodne podatke za svoju tezu, s toga mogu reći da sam ja u stvari čovjek iz džungle, ali sa PMF. 49 years of work of the Department of Geography and 19 years of the Department of Tourism show just how rich the experience of the Department of Geography, Tourism and Hospitality Management is. The Department of Geography, Tourism and Hotel Management provides teaching within six chairs. The Chair of Physical Geography, the Chair of Human Geography and Geography Education and Teaching Methodology, the Chair of Tourism, the Chair of Hospitality and the Chair of Hunting Tourism. Apart from teaching and science, the Department of Geography, Tourism and Hotel Management developed a strong publishing activity. The department publishes an international science journal, Geographica Pannonica, that deals with the geography and tourism, as well as the popular science magazine, GER. My study on geography started quite naively. Kao i svaki mladi čovek, pratio sam neke svoje želje, neke svoje ambicije. Ja sam od uvijek volao prostor, volao sam prirodu, volao sam teren. Jednostavno, zbog toga sam smatrao da studiranje na geografiji stvarno pruža sve te mogućnosti koje bi faktički ispunilo moje snove. 
Trenutno moja uža naučna oblast je geonasledđe i geoturizam, dakle neka vrsta amalgama geografije, odnosno geonauka i turizma koje se izučavaju na našem departmanu, s obzirom da je naša obseg istraživanja poslednjih milion godina, a da je zemlja stara oko 4,5 milijarde godina, ostavit ćemo mnogo prostora i za dalje generacije da se bave ovom vrstom istraživanja. The Department of Physics is divided into five chairs. The Chair of Condensed Matter Experimental Physics focuses above all on the study groups with physicists of different profiles and the courses that deal with physics of condensed matter, hard matter in materials, new materials in medicine, dentistry and other fields of science. The Chair of Physics and Electronics was established in 1969 when the researchers at the Faculty of Sciences started working on physics of ionized gases and plasma. The courses in nuclear physics, elementary particle, electricity and magnetism physics, biophysics and environmental protection are conducted within the Chair of Nuclear Physics. The research on theoretical condensed matter physics, or more specifically the layered ferro and antiferromagnetic and other magnetic systems with complex magnetic gratings, is conducted by the Chair of Theoretical Physics. The Chair of General Physics and Physics Education and Teaching Methodology is connected with the Teaching Laboratory of Medical Physics, the Teaching Laboratory of Mechanics and Thermodynamics, as well as with Teaching Physics and the Teaching Laboratory of General Physics. The department publishes the Journal of Research in Physics. Fizika nas kao fundamentalna nauka usmjerava da učimo iz dokaza o prirodi stvari, potom stalno tragamo za primjenom naučenog i na kraju steknemo sposobnost i sami da otkrivamo dokaze o prirodi stvari. Od malena sam maštala da postanem nuklearni fizičar, zato što je to uvijek bilo primamljivo, nepoznato, donekle primamljivo zato što je opasno. PMF se meni, a i većini ostalih koji nastoje da razmišljanjem prevere vrijeme nametnuo kao prirodan izbor i smatram da ljudima koji se odluče da upišu PMF obezbeđuje sigurnije znanje i budućnost. Iako sam novosadsko dete, studije astronomije sam završila u Beogradu, pošto tada ih nije bilo ovde u Novom Sadu, ali sam nakon toga otišla u Ameriku gde sam završila doktorske studije na Univerzitetu Illinoisa, međutim, posle toga sam odlučila da se vratim kuću u Novi Sad. Na moju veliku sreću, od 2002. godine su se konačno otvorile studije astronomije u Novom Sadu sa možda nešto malo drugačijim konceptom od onih koje postoje još uvek u Beogradu, Imamo nešto malo savremenije predmete, novije, kojima se danas u svetu posvećuje jako velika pažnja. Ja recimo predajem na nekim od tih predmeta gde, osim što pokušam da prenesem znanje našim studentima, pokušam i to da uradim na neki možda malo moderniji način na koji možda nisu navikli do sada, ali ovako dosta dobro to prihvataju. The Department of Chemistry, Biochemistry and Environmental Protection grew from the Chair of Chemistry at the Faculty of Philosophy that was established back in 1961. This year it celebrates 50 years of chemistry at the University of Novi Sad. The department focuses on knowledge acquisition through research, knowledge transfer through education and practical application. In addition, the department has also developed its own publishing activity in the field of environmental protection through the publication called Water Quality. The department provides education and research through seven chairs. The Chair of Analytical Chemistry, the Chair of Biochemistry and Chemistry of Natural Products, the Chair of Physical Chemistry, the Chair of Chemical Technology and Environmental Protection, the Chair of Chemistry Education and Teaching Methodology, the Chair of Organic Chemistry and the Chair of General and Inorganic Chemistry. Još od gimnazije znala sam da prirodne nauke nemaju drugu alternativu. Zato sam i upisala biohemiju na prirodno-matematičkom fakultetu u mom gradu, Novom Sadu. Sudiranje je bilo teško, ali vredelo je. Profesori su nam preneli fenomenalno znanje koje je aktuelno. I sada, posle osam godina studiranja i stičenja iskustva na prirodno-matematičkom fakultetu, nalazim se u Londonu na usavršavanju. Na Svetskom univerzitetu, na UCL-u, gde samo redki dobiju priliku da provedu par godina tamo. I posle toga vratit ću se na prirodno matematički fakultet gde ću svo znanje ovde uložiti na istraživanja i naravno preneti iskustvo na nove studente.